Imagine a place where the sun always smiles, where history whispers in every corner, and where the sea is as clear as crystal. Welcome to Malta. Nestled heartily in the Mediterranean Sea, Malta is a small archipelago that packs an enormous punch. Its strategic location has made it a coveted prize for empires across the centuries, from the Phoenicians to the British. Today it's a vibrant blend of cultures where the past and the present dance in a timeless waltz. Malta's rich tapestry of history is etched into its streets, its buildings, and the hearts of its people. From the silent city of Medina to the bustling capital of Valletta, every corner has a story to tell. But let's not forget nature's own masterpiece. Malta's coastline boasts beautiful beaches, stunning cliffs, and crystal clear waters, making it a haven for outdoor enthusiasts. Ready to explore this Mediterranean paradise? Hold tight as we embark on a day-long adventure. As dawn breaks, the city of Valletta awakens, bathed in the warm glow of the rising sun. This is a city that is both a living testament to its storied past and a vibrant hub of culture and cuisine. Our first stop is St. John's Co-Cathedral, an architectural marvel that is as much a tribute to the grandeur of the Knights of St. John as it is a sanctuary of tranquility. The cathedral's interior is a feast for the eyes, adorned with intricately carved stone walls and a ceiling that is a masterpiece of Baroque art. Here, history whispers in hushed tones, telling tales of knights, nobility, and faith. Once you've soaked in the majesty of the cathedral, it's time to head to the bustling Republic Street. This is the heart of Valletta, a thoroughfare where the past and present coexist. As you stroll down the street, you'll find a captivating blend of old-world charm and modernity. Traditional Maltese balconies jostle for space with trendy boutiques and art galleries, creating a delightful juxtaposition that is quintessentially Valletta. And what better way to truly immerse oneself in the local culture than to partake in a traditional Maltese breakfast? Step into one of the cozy cafes lining the streets and treat yourself to pastizzi, a flaky pastry filled with ricotta or peas, accompanied by a strong cup of coffee. As you savor the flavors of Malta, Watch as the city awakens around you, each corner coming alive with the rhythm of the day. Valletta is a city that is as rich in experiences as it is in history. Every corner, every street, every stone has a story to tell. And as the morning unfolds, you find yourself becoming a part of that narrative. It's a city that invites you to explore, to discover, and to fall in love with its unique charm. Leaving the charming streets of Valletta, our next stop is a place of timeless beauty. As the morning sun climbs higher, we find ourselves in Medina, the silent city. Often referred to as the noble city, Medina has been standing tall since around 4,000 years ago. It has seen the reign of Romans, Arabs, and Normans, each leaving their indelible mark on the city's architectural and cultural landscape. The city's aura of antiquity is palpable in every corner, from the narrow, winding streets to the grand palazzos that bear silent witness to the passage of time. The city walls of Medina offer a breathtaking panoramic view of the Maltese islands. As you walk along the bastions, you'll gaze at the patchwork of fields, the glimmering sea, and the distant towns, each with their own tale to tell. It's a sight that reminds us of the island's rich history and the countless stories that it cradles within its shores. No visit to Medina is complete without stepping into the majestic St. Paul's Cathedral. This architectural marvel is a testament to the city's resilience and faith. The cathedral's grand Baroque facade stands in stark contrast to the medieval streets of Medina. But step inside, and you'll be greeted by a world of opulence and artistry. The cathedral's frescoed ceilings, marble columns, and ornate altars are a feast for the eyes, a tribute to the generations of artists who poured their skill and devotion into every detail. St. Paul's Cathedral is not just a place of worship, but a symbol of the city's deep-rooted faith. It's said that the Apostle Paul himself resided in Medina after being shipwrecked on the island. His presence is still felt in the city today, adding a layer of spiritual significance to this historical masterpiece. And so, as we leave the silent streets of Medina behind, we carry with us the echoes of its history, the beauty of its views, and the reverence of its cathedral. This is the charm of Medina, a city that speaks volumes without uttering a word. From the quiet elegance of Medina, we head to the southern coast for a midday thrill. As the sun reaches its zenith, we arrive at our next destination, the stunning Blue Grotto. The Blue Grotto, a collection of sea caves on the southern coast of Malta, is a charming spectacle that nature has generously gifted this island. The journey to the grotto is an adventure in itself. A traditional Maltese boat known as a dgajsa 
carries us across the azure waters, cutting through the gentle waves. The boat ride, a blend of thrill and serenity, offers a front row seat to the breathtaking beauty of the Mediterranean. As we approach the caves, the water's color intensifies, transforming into a mesmerizing shade of deep blue. This is where the Blue Grotto earns its name. The sunlight, filtering through the underwater flora, reflects off the white sandy seabed, illuminating the caves in an ethereal glow. It's a spectacle that's both enchanting and surreal, a testament to the unspoiled beauty of Malta's natural landscapes. But the Blue Grotto offers more than just a visual feast. For those with an adventurous spirit, it presents an opportunity to delve deeper into the depths of the Mediterranean. Snorkeling and diving here is a unique experience. As you submerge yourself in the crystal clear waters, you're treated to an underwater world teeming with marine life. From schools of colorful fish to the slow dance of underwater plants, it's a scene straight out of a fantasy. The Blue Grotto is more than just a place. It's an experience, an emotion. It's the feeling of being one with nature, of being a part of something larger than ourselves. It's the thrill of adventure and the peace of tranquility all wrapped into one. It's a reminder of the beautiful complexity and diversity of our world, a place where the land, sea, and sky merge in a harmonious symphony. From the exhilarating blue grotto, we move to a tranquil ending to our day. As we leave the grotto, carrying with us memories of a day well spent, we look forward to the promise of more such adventures on this remarkable island. As the day gives way to twilight, we find ourselves in the picturesque fishing village of Marsexlok. Nestled on the southeastern coast of Malta, this charming haven is a vibrant tapestry of culture, history, and tradition. Greeting the evening with a warm Mediterranean glow, Marsaxlok is home to a fleet of traditional fishing boats, known as Luzus. Adorned with vibrant hues of blue, yellow, red, and green, these boats are not just a means of livelihood for the locals, but also a symbol of the village's rich maritime legacy. Each Luzu bears the iconic Eye of Osiris, an ancient Phoenician symbol of protection, painted on its bow, silently watching over the fishermen as they navigate the azure waters of the Mediterranean Sea. The heart of Marsaxlok, however, beats in its bustling fish market. Every day, as the Luzus return from the sea, they bring with them a bounty of the freshest catch. From swordfish to octopus, the market is a seafood lover's paradise. The air is filled with an intoxicating blend of the salty sea breeze and the tantalizing aroma of fresh seafood, creating an atmosphere that's truly unique to Marsaxlok. And what better way to end the day than by dining at a waterfront restaurant, feasting on seafood that's as fresh as it gets? Here, the culinary art of Malta comes to life in dishes that are a delightful fusion of Mediterranean flavors and local ingredients. From aljada, a traditional Maltese fish soup, to lampuki pie, a seasonal delicacy made from Dorado, the food in Marsaxlok is a testament to Malta's rich culinary heritage. As twilight deepens and the stars begin to twinkle in the clear Mediterranean sky, the sounds of laughter, clinking glasses, and soft music fill the air, painting a picture of a vibrant community that's deeply connected to its roots. As the sun sets on our day in Malta, we're left with memories of a land that's as enchanting as it is diverse. A day in Malta promises an unforgettable blend of history, culture, adventure, and gastronomy. We started our journey in the vibrant city of Valletta, where the morning light breathed life into the ancient stone structures. We then ventured into the silent city of Medina, a place where time seems to have stood still. As the day progressed, we found ourselves at the Blue Grotto, a natural wonder that left us in awe of its beauty. And as the sun set, we ended our day in the colorful fishing village of Marsaxlok, feasting on the freshest seafood. Malta is not just a destination, it's a journey that stirs the senses, a place that intertwines the past with the present. It's a feast for the eyes, a delight for the palate, a thrill for the spirit. It's a hidden gem in the heart of the Mediterranean, waiting to be discovered. So when are you packing your bags for Malta? Remember, a world of beauty, history, and adventure awaits you. Travel with us at Jet Set We Go Travel, your passport to unforgettable journey. Visit www.jetsetwegotravel.com.